Welcome everyone. Uh, it's my pleasure to present Takako uh, Nemoto from JIST, uh, which is Japan Institute for Japan Advanced Institute for Science and Technology. <laughs> uh, and you will be speaking on systems of constructive rigorous mathematics. Thank you very Thank you. much for the I'm very happy to present uh, my talk here. Uh, this, uh, sorry, this is not a uh, recent my result, but a kind of survey of the system for reverse mathematics in constructive mathematics. And uh, why I give, I'm giving this talk is uh, I'm currently writing a survey on the, uh, constructive reverse mathematics, and uh, just this is uh, in the, uh, under the preparation I set up this talk. So, uh, I'm sorry, uh, some of my slides contain some Japanese. Of course, these slides are pre uh, prepared for talk in Japanese, and all the, everything was in, written in Japanese, but I translated uh, them in uh, English. So, the first thing, uh, content. Uh, first, I'll talk about what is reverse mathematics. And uh, the most famous reverse mathematics is Friedman and Simpson's reverse mathematics, which is done over, uh, over classical logic using language of arithmetic. And I introduce intuitionistic logic and uh, reverse mathematics. Uh, in the abstract, I wrote several things about constructive reverse mathematics. Uh, in particular, uh, the one uh, done in over high, uh, higher order arithmetic and one done in over first order arithmetic, but I found it too much uh, to talk one hour of talk. So I focused on the system of the reverse mathematics uh, with the second order uh, language, second order uh, language of second order arithmetic. So what is reverse mathematics? Actually, that is uh, something very uh, popular in usual mathematics. Usual mathematics, we, uh, from some assumption A, uh, we have some conclusion B, and we want to uh, make the assumption weaker, as much weaker as possible. And sometimes we found that uh, if we weaken enough the assumption, then actually the assumption is equivalent to conclusion. Such thing happened, uh, so a very famous example is a uh, uh, Tholm's dilemma and Asana choice, or uh, more something, uh, something very elementary is uh, the convergence of uh, real sequences and uh, pos uh, the sequences, positive sequences. So, but if we take this assumption A as a, some set comprehension action, then this classification, make a classification of mathematical theorems by, a, uh, by set comprehension, that is, uh, we have a common measure to, uh, for mathematical theorems. That is a Friedman Simpson reverse mathematics program. Uh, so, it's a reverse, uh, so the reverse, uh, reverse mathematics is a classification of, of mathematical theorems within a common measure, like set comprehension or uh, some other principle. And famous one, Friedman and Simpson's reverse mathematics is a mathematics <coughs> of uh, using classical logic and using system or systems of second order arithmetic. And if we speak the reverse mathematics, which it's usually it means three months and seems of reverse mathematics. So what is the language of second order arithmetic in three months and seems of reverse mathematics? Uh, so I call it L2 here. That consists of uh, constants 0 and 1 that is obviously intended to uh, present uh, natural number 0 and natural number 1. And binary functions plus and times, and uh, binary relations for first order element or the user order, and membership relation between natural number and set of natural number. 
Oh, sorry, this language is intended to represent natural number and set of natural number. So we have two sorts of variables. Uh, first order variables and second order variables intended to uh, in intended to set of natural number. And we only have first order equal. Uh, Axioms of uh, the system RC node is a uh, very simple, just normal uh, basic arithmetic, successor, and addition, and multiplication, and order, and consists of the sigma zero and induction. That is a uh, 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 induction principle, but not full induction, restricted to uh, restricted the class for sigma the one I will explain later. And it has also a uh, set comprehension action for delta the one comprehension. That is uh, roughly speaking uh, we allow to be uh, we allow the we have a set which is recursively defined. The, this is a classification of formula. So the formula is said to be phi zero zero if it is built up from atomic formulas by means of uh, uh, connectives uh, and or negation <coughs> and implication and bounded number quantifiers. Bounded means the quantifier in this form. And if this part is phi zero k, then adding one existential quantifier, unbounded existential quantifier, we have the class sigma zero k plus one. And I define it classically. Uh, and I don't use higher order. Uh, uh, second order of files here and the class phi zero phi one k plus one is of the form this one but usually it is defined as the form for all x phi x and here it is sigma zero k then it is phi zero k plus one. So sigma zero one means uh, some bounded formula so this is so here the induction is limited only for sigma zero uh, formula. Uh, so the system RC not is commonly used for base theory of reverse mathematics, and actually this. Zero means uh, the minimum induction principle, but uh, it's slightly stronger sigma zero one because we only have uh, recursive comprehension that is recursive set means definable both by sigma zero one formula and phi zero one formula. So sometimes we need more weaker system uh, that is called RCN not to start. Uh, roughly speaking, uh, we want wanted uh, system of uh, for reverse mathematics for this uh, system of reverse mathematics. Uh, only the induction of this uh, of weakest induction. So uh, induction only on. For this form, but uh, to do something analysis, etc., we need uh, coding of finite sequence. But without sigma zero one induction, we cannot current, uh, we cannot prove the existence of exponentiation function. So to do some meaningful uh, mathematics, we need exponentiation. So we add uh, exponential uh, exponentiation to the fun of the functions in the ramets. So we extend the ramets and we can, uh, it should be sigma zero zero or phi zero zero, uh, we can the induction only for sigma zero zero, or phi zero zero, 
So here the relationship between RC node and RC node star. So uh, as I told that uh, uh, RC node in RC node exponentiation is definable using sigma zero induction. So because the language of RC node star is enhanced. Uh, comparing to the language of RC node. So uh, RC node can be added to RC node star, and that is uh, actually a conservative extension. On the other hand, RC node star itself does not prove sigma zero induction. We can prove it. And uh, this difference appears also for the universal function. Uh, Primitive Gaussian, uh, so that is a way to compose new functions from existing function, uh, is uh, uh, one way to compose a new function. Primitive Gaussian is not available in RC not star, but limited Gaussian, primitive Gaussian, both bounded Gaussian, is available in RC not star. So, so the difference of primitive recursion and bounded recursion is of course. Primitive recursion is, how to say, just it allows iteration of function application uh, as much as we want. But uh, bounded recursion is not uh, uh, bounded recursion here, meaning some bound, existing bound to repeat the function. Repeat the application. So, uh, this difference also appears the uh, uh, class of probably total function of the system in the system RC node and RC node star. I will talk about it later. And here are some list of uh, Friedman and Simpson and Simpson reverse mathematics. Uh, the following are equivalent over RC node. Uh, first, isometrical comprehension, that is the uh, set comprehension axioms uh, defined by arithmetical formula, that is a uh, uh, formula without uh, set, co uh, set codifiers. And for example, value stars, theorem, I should, I should have put space here. And monotone convergence theorem, and weekly Cauchy sequence convergence. That weekly Cauchy sequence means uh, we have no we have no modulus for cosines as a function, and they are all uh, real uh, theorems from real analysis, and we also have some equivalence uh, for us from algebra that if every countable field has an algebra closure. Every countable vector space of a countable field has a basis, or, or every pair of countable fields, there is a trans a transcend data base, and every commutative ring has a maximum ideal, etc. And, uh, and maybe for some of you are interested in Kenish lemma, read Kenish lemma. Uh, normal Kenish lemma. Is equivalent to arithmetical comprehension. That is slightly longer uh, than uh, Keynes' name of binary three and Ramsey several for standard uh, natural number greater than or equal to three. And interesting thing, uh, you, in usual mathematics, we never compare theorems from analysis and theorems from algebra. But we can measure by a common uh, set co uh, common measure of set comprehension axiom. And ACA mode that is uh, that consists of RC node plus arithmetical comprehension is called uh, ACA uh, 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 ACA node consists of RC node plus arithmetical comprehension. That is one of big five systems of Friedman and Simpson reverse mathematics. Another famous uh, one famous system of reverse mathematics is WK node. That 
consists of arsenal plus weak chemistry. What is weak chemistry? That is uh, chemistry, but we can do the, the binary tree. That means P is, uh, consists of binary sequence and close band uh, uh, restriction. So every infinite binary tree, that means every uh, every tree which has any uh, of uh, branches has infinite path. And it is equivalent uh, Heidelberg covering theorem uh, and every continuous function on the close the interval is uniformly continuous or has infimum as a, a minimum value or uh, it is Riemann integral, integral. And uh, it's also equivalent to get it in the get it complete theorem and every countable ring contains a printed prime idea and Brower fixed point theorem and there was existing theorem for Solution of ordinary differential equation and separable harm perhaps. So it's a WK is a more tricky system. Okay. Uh, short question. Yeah. Uh, Gödel's completeness theorem, you probably mean it for countably countable signatures? Ah, yes. yes. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Yes, I should not explain it. Yeah. Okay. And using weaker uh weaker bench theory uh for Arsenal star will have this equivalence. Uh, this is only equivalent with uh, uh, sigma zero induction. Uh, of course, some theorems are equivalent over WK, we can stream over Arsenal star. I didn't list it here, but uh, we can find some mathematical theorems equivalent to sigma zero induction. That is the uh, real why we define uh, use. We got a story and set of stuff that is uh, one of them is uh, bounded sigma zero comprehension. It, it is not real set comprehension, but bounded, uh, for, uh, bounded to some natural number. So up to n, we have a set comprehension defined by sigma zero formula. And uh, some of them are from uh, some. Uh, some of, some of them are from uh, algebra that is for every countable field k, every polynomial has only finite many roots and every finitely generated vector, vector space over any countable field has spaces and uh, structural theorem of finitely generated abelian groups and various category So we have Many results uh, in Friedman and Simpson's reverse mathematics. Uh, but they are all uh, over classical logic. We want to do it, it on uh, constructive logic or intuitionistic logic. So, user, uh, so user mathematics is based on classical logic, and as you know, constructive mathematics based on intuitionistic logic. And the notion of proof are different. Uh, so both in both classical and constructive mathematics, if there is a proof of C, then P is to not not vice versa. And uh, intuitionistic logic, so for intuitionist logic, we often uh, is often uh, uh, explained by hiding a grammar hiding formal interpretation. That is, proof of A and B should be a pair of proof of A and B, and or is a proof of A or B is a pair of information. Which one is uh, the first one is index to for which statement we have a proof, and the second one is a proof of uh, the statement, and. A plus B, uh, proof of A plus B is a function F that is to combat any proof of P 
uh, any group of B is uh, for any group of B uh, A, if B is a group of B. So it's a kind of procedure. And for negation, it's a proof of A guys bottom. And the proof of for all X and X fold is a function which sends X to the proof of AX. If this X, a proof of if this X is a pair of the object P and proof B, that is uh, B is the object satisfying A D and uh, B is a proof of A D. So, so this is uh, also called DXK interpretation and uh, mathematics based on such logic is called constructive mathematics. Uh, I think the most famous uh, mathematics of a indigenous project is Bishop's style constructive mathematics. And I think that is heavily depending on BHK application. Maybe, I think, maybe some of you know better than I. Uh, so, so uh, uh, in indigenous project, we cannot prove by contradiction because even if we prove that A implies contradiction, we have no, uh, no proof A itself. And they admit at least bishop style constructive mathematics has missed countable choice and the Braxton choice because if for x exists y, we have, if we have, then uh, by BHK interpretation, we have the procedure to send for any x. Uh, 
but a uh, famous uh, research of analysis. So many, uh, many results from analysis, modern analysis are contained in this book. And so, so first attempt of uh, reverse mathematics over inducionistic logic is done to investigate the equivalence of mathematical theorems over Bishop's style inducionistic uh, Bishop's style constructive mathematics. That is uh, what I call here non-formalized reverse mathematics. Uh, but uh, before that, I should have mentioned Bishop himself uh, might not like formal, uh, formalized mathematics or formalization of mathematics. So, uh, follow up of Bishop the, the reverse mathematics uh, over Bishop style mathematics that means not formalized, set, or not formalized, non formalized setting. So, they investigate the equivalence of uh, non constant uh, of mathematical theorems to non constructive principles uh, like uh, list uh, LPO, uh, list uh, limited principle of omniscience, or Markov's principle and LPO. They are a kind of uh, low excluded middle, what I've previously mentioned, low. And there are some examples. Actually, I made a list of uh, the result of the uh, reverse mathematics over Bishop style mathematics. It's huge. It's a huge list, and uh, many, many, uh, many uh, most of the research are from constructive analysis. So many equivalents are developed uh, for the theorems from analysis. But there are some examples. Uh, Neural behaviorness, uh, that is a kind of property of linear mapping of non uh, non space, is equivalent to a limited principle of, of omniscience. That is, uh, we, I, if I formalize it, it could be called a sigma zero one log excluded middle, and some are more than. Uh, this is a recent result, uh, a result a few years ago about separating hyperplane theorem and Markov's principle, a kind of double negation information. If, we, if I formalize it, it could be called a sigma zero one uh, double negation information. And we can extremely and LLPO. LLPO is a kind of small that's low, etc. And the feature of, uh, so by the way, there are uh, some of research on this field. And recently, uh, but it was already several years ago, uh, Hannes Dinner had a, uh, wrote a thick application script about this constructive uh, mathematics. And the feature of this is uh, their results. Uh, uh, heavily depending on the use of countable action of choice and induction. Some, uh, for example, uh, the equivalence of B, Penis, Lemma, and LLPO is usually, uh, if we don't use countable action of choice, we cannot prove this equivalence. Uh, we need some kind of dependent choice to, to, uh, for this uh, equivalence. And, uh, and using, uh, they also use complex induction. So this result separating hyperplane theorem and then P is actually using uh, pi, pi one two or pi sigma one two induction if I formalize it. And good thing is uh, because they are not use they don't. They don't use any formal language, so they have no limitation of arithmetic. So one of the weak points of Friedman and Simpson's reverse mathematics uh, is uh, limited to the language of arithmetic. So we cannot use, uh, we cannot consider any field or any vector space 
that we always need countable or separable assumption. And in, for example, this separating hyperplane theorem, they use, they didn't assume any separability for space. That is the one feature of this general style of reverse mathematics. But, uh, to, but we also interested in uh, class, uh, formalization of class, uh, formalization of constructive reverse mathematics. So we use uh, formal logic. I think many of you know uh, natural deduction. This is classical one. And just remaining classical law uh, bottom. Uh, we have a uh, intuitionist logic, and <coughs> for formal for system of constructive reverse mathematics, actually we don't have fixed systems or fixed languages. Not yet. but one feature of formal, uh, one feature of them is using uh, language uh, of arithmetic but not for natural number and set of natural number, but the language for natural number and functions of natural number. Uh, I think, I don't know if the uh, exact reason of it, but one of the things using uh, to use functions of natural number, we, atomic formula is, if we only have the equation for first order, Object atomic formula is always this form T equals S. What uh, atomic formula are always this form. Yeah. So we can prove uh, law of excluded middles for this formula by industry. But if we use set based language containing x in x as atomic formula, we don't have, we cannot prove x in x or not x in x, even we restrict this x to a set of natural numbers. So I think one of the, uh, so this is a, uh, uh, this is one of good things to use uh, language for function based, uh, uh, to use language based on functions of natural numbers. Anyway, there are several systems, several, uh, several systems, and uh, the systems are classified into three, three based theories. One is a system with the strength of ACA node, relatively strong. And another one is a uh, system of, of the strengths like RC node. And another one is a uh, system with the strengths of RC node star. First, uh, I think this, so I think this is the first one uh, to appear in literature, I guess. This is the called the system uh, WKB that is uh, consist that the language consists of uh, user uh, constant number zero and successor pairing projection and lambda operator for functors, fun functions and, uh, and so on. So the name in R three is uh, stands for. Uh, the name of system is, uh, stands for B Queen Battery. It consists basic arithmetic for successors and pairing and projection for user tests and uh, user application action for user action for equality and lambda conversion and primitive conversion and unique choice. So this unique choice is something uh, replacement of uh, because of the answer action of set based system and it contains full induction. This is 
suggested by uh, Iris, Iris Rock, and the, uh, she proved that fan theory every is a kind of contraposition of weak kind of theorem. Uh, fan theorem every binary tree with no even passive bounded, and every continuous function on zero one is bounded. And something similar system is suggested for supervisor uh, it's called BIN. The, the system is uh, almost similar, uh, almost the same. The main difference is the uh, lacking lambda structure. That is suggested by Winkelmann, and he also proved a uh, similar system, but in his paper, they he uh, it contains, uh, they have mo much more results. And their uh, actually, the system BIM and uh, WKB uh, inspired by system called EM, that is elementary analysis, uh, that is suggested by seven, uh, 1970 by uh, Reiser and Trielstra. Uh, the main difference of the uh, the main difference is the uh, language that contains all primitive recursive functions and uh, they contain uh, as an axiom defining equations. So that is not that is uh, uh, language have, is already in language. But the systems are very similar. Uh, it, it has a basic arithmetic action and uh, defining equations of primitive recursive functions because they have uh, all symbols for primitive recursive functions and inductions and the under conversion, primitive recursion of quantified the action of choice. And uh, about the strengths of W. KB and PIM and EM. Uh, actually, they are, they are uh, sorry, in interpretable. We, have, we can uh, we can find uh, construct a function to send its formula to the other language, and uh, they are equally consistent. If one of them uh, proves contradiction, all of them proves contradiction, and. Uh, but how strong they are they? Uh, the system, so, because uh, these three systems, WKB, BRM, and EL, have the same consistent strengths, uh, we only check uh, one, uh, we should only, uh, if, if we can compare one, uh, one of them with the classical system, then it's enough. So, uh, actually, in no, I know what uh, <laughs> it's Trellstra's book, 90s, I think, 1973 book. It is proves that EL and HJ are materially interpretable. HJ is a hiding arithmetic, first order arithmetic, and uh, over intuitionistic logic. It's a kind of uh, pair arithmetic over intuitionistic logic, and they are. They are also material inter uh, they, they are also uh, have the same consistency strength that is proved by uh, a translation and and then PA and AC node this these two classical systems have the same proof theory quadrants that is another proof theory uh, technique of proof theory that is uh, to to measure the least ordinal to uh, to prove the consistency of them, so we have such picture. So W K B W K B and B I M and B M. They are materially interpretable, and it is also interpretable with HA 
and here for a j we have phi dot two if, uh, conservation with p a and to a j node we have same crucial ordinal. So that is a picture to compare the strengths of them for reverse post-reactive reverse mathematics and uh, system of classical reverse mathematics. So we need several techniques of cons uh, comparing the strengths and the uh, strength and strengths is a bit uh, complicated work here. Mm, I will talk something more about weaker systems for reverse mathematics. So, of course, we uh, formalization of constructive reverse mathematics is intended. Uh, one of the purposes uh, might be uh, comparing to Gritman and Simpson reverse mathematics. So, we need something similar for RCN. So, that is suggested, uh, but EF or their systems are too strong because they are, in a sense, they have the same strength with ACA node. That is, uh, that is the one uh, not best theory for Friedman and Simpson's reverse mathematics. So we want weakening system. Uh, one attempt is just we uh, just use the same language as EF, but uh, we can only the induction. This system. Uh, so we get the induction into the induction or the uh, formula, but all other are same answer. Then, actually, so this system is called EL0. Of course, this zero is inspired by this uh, RCMO, this zero. And Maybe you remember that RCA node has a sigma zero one induction, but this only has phi zero zero induction. But uh, because we have a recursor in year zero, it's the same language as year, so we have primitive recursion built in, uh, built in the system. So that means we can prove sigma zero one induction in this system. Um. Very naive question, um, but axiom for successor? Oh, yes. Is it sufficient as stated? I would have expected that you write, it's not the case, but SN ah, equals zero. That's it. Actually, that is enough. Okay, yeah. Yes, we can, uh, so because we have the defining method, uh, that is a uh, sigma zero one induction. Okay. So we can prove the sigma zero one induction in the system. Yeah. So okay. Have, okay. So, yes, that is a good point. So, we have very, in this system, we have infinite language, but the form of axioms are very simple. Mm -hmm. So it's sometimes useful when we consider the translation. So that is one advantage of this system. And actually, this system has already suggested by Ryder and Dorestra, but uh, uh, Ishihara used this system for the mathematics, and he proved, uh, or we proved, that intermediate value theorem that is proved in RCA not plus in classical reverse mathematics is actually uh, non trivial in constructive reverse mathematics that is equivalent to the kind of weak Chinese framework. And uh, Another suggestion for, for the system, EL0, uh, another, another suggestion for the system with the strength of RC node is uh, it's a bit complicated, but it's, it's also called EL0. I use different ones. So the main difference, it's almost the same system, but the main difference is the language is finite. We only have uh, plus and addition and exponentiation, and we have final relation. Then, 
uh, the system this year zero has uh, uh, except for the induction it's finite finite functions because we only have finite functions but the form of actions a bit complicated uh, especially for orders or successors and uh, actually this is used in my uh, my paper with Kentaro Sato. The main purpose of this system is uh, uh, to make um, interpretation, easy interpretation with R symbol. That is why we restrict uh, function symbols. And <clears throat> And yes, so and uh, this this uh, year zero and uh, this these two year zero are actually much more interpretable, and this year zero uh, bold face in the year zero uh, and also not are much more interpretable uh, using posing actions. Uh, on the picture is so function based language and set based language uh, uh, interpreter using uh, so regard uh, so regarding set as a characteristic fun function of sets so actually that. Uh, we can make uh, interpretation from RC node to <laughs> EN0 uh, with bold face plus plus our logic and using And uh, double negation translation, we can construct a translation EL0 plus a kind of non constructed principle called MP, and using cosine, we can make the uh, interpretation to EL. Anyway, we can uh, then these systems are much more interpretable, and so it's uh, has the same consistency strengths, so if one of them are in, uh, inconsistent, all of them are inconsistent. So we have the system strength with RC not now. So you had just appealed to the law of exclusion middle on the meta level? Uh, okay. Yes. <laughs> yes. I have to be careful. Yes. <laughs> okay, so, but. It's not uh, the system like RC node. It's not weak enough sometimes. So <coughs> we want to imitate RC node star in constructive mathematics. Constructive reverse mathematics. Uh, one suggestion is a uh, system called ELR. So oh, you mean it's not weak enough for for to what? Hmm? It's not weak enough for for what? Uh, so, some, to investigate equivalence with sigma zero induction, we want we want a system without which is which does not prove sigma zero induction. So we so in the previous system EL zero it contains primitive recursion, primitive recursion so we won't remove it. <laughs> so that is the idea for ELM. It so EL zero they have primitive because primitive because uh, operator but it's as it has disappeared here but we only we have bounded minimization to use to make the function universe as a elementary function. We only have functions for elementary recursive function and other things are very similar or similar as Zero, and it they are same actions, successors and defining relations for elementary functions and hydrogen induction, 
come down the bottom part. Mm -hmm. This is the limitation for uh, for, for elements of bounded because of or bounded minimization, not primitive because of itself. And something so something similar is suggested also uh, using that is finite language. So for year zero, we have two year zero is full face, and this we can do year LM. And this is you can year L zero star. Of course, this star is inspired by Ancient of star. Thus, this system here, the star, consists of uh, and use the same language as the uh, year zero with full face and same action for basic arithmetic. But uh, for function, uh, for this, we, we need functions, uh, restriction of functions, so we introduce restriction uh, axon of restriction of sequences and uh, something similar for bounded minimization we add axons for bounded search and uh, the main difference from ELN and this EL zero star is the existence of this quantifying free axon of choice and or sigma to the So the system whole phase year zero is intended to make uh, interpretation with RCMO. And this is intended to make uh, interpretation with RCMO star. And the idea to add quantifying free action choice is to interpret uh, uh, set comprehension, uh, recursive comprehension into this system. Because <coughs> ELM has no uh, quantifying free choice, it's difficult to interpret this RCM star directly. But these two systems have same uh, consistency strengths in a sense. Uh, I'll explain it later. Before that, uh, there are some results from uh, reverse mathematics over year M or year zero star. Uh, for example, uh, weak case lemma is equivalent to Cantor's intersection theorem. Actually, this is proved in the, some previous paper by Elise, but she proved it over AC, uh, she proved it over uh, WKB, a uh, slightly stronger system. Actually, the equivalence is proved very, over very weak systems. And another equivalence is uh, uh, fan theorem and high level errors covering theorem. In classical reverse mathematics, high level errors covering theorems are uh, proved to be equivalent with weak case theorem, but actually, in constructive reverse mathematics, uh, we found that it's actually equivalent to the Contraposition, a kind of contraposition of weak time step. And they are proved by Sihara. And, and another equivalence that is proved over here, the star, that is uh, uh, sigma zero and induction is equivalent to Bell's category theory. I think this result is difficult to prove over year LM because I use uh, a quantifier free choice. So there are some results over some, uh, there are some results year LM and year zero star. And about the strengths of year LM and year zero, uh, here, year zero and RC not, uh, year zero star and RC not star, we can construct uh, we can construct interpretation. Again, we need some forcing. So we, actually, we have to construct the here. 
EL seven star plus omega square zero and plus and EL seven star plus omega square zero something like that and the strength of them uh, we have we can see that they have the same consistency strength another way that is the plugable total functions of ELM and EL0 that is a, that is a universal function uh, whose totality of root is exactly the class of elementary recursive function. So the totality is always has a form for always if this slide if this slide a x y uniquely existing and this is quantified uh, this is bounded formula. So actually then we can see that ELM and E L star proves the same pattern of sentences and the same and so the same consistency terms. So because here we have the uh, we can prove they their consistency strengths are the same. So we can conclude that all of them uh, have the same consistency strength. So this so we have uh, so we have three kinds of base systems, base theories for reverse mathematics. A constructive reverse mathematics that is the uh, same strength as AC node and RC node and RC node star. And uh, yes, uh, I should have my daughter draw us as a picture, but we have a complicated map to interpret them. But anyway, we have, uh, we have such picture. And they are references and that's all I wanted to talk here today. Thank you very much. Any questions? <coughs> yeah, um, I got a further very naive one. Uh, namely, um, maybe I catched it wrong. At some point, I think, in the beginning, you said that the axiom of countable choice yes. and full induction yes. implies the axiom of dependent choice? Yes. Aha, uh -huh. okay, I did not know that. Uh, Is the argument easy or? Yes. Okay, good. <laughs> uh, so, so, anyway, so we have a assumption for elementary recursive functions and we have a something. Yeah. Then by induction, we can repeatedly take yes, the yes, as yeah. a sequence. Yeah. That's the that's that's point we need induction. Uh -huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Of course, how to formalize the dependent choices? Yes, right. Yeah. yeah. So, do you have any experience how constructive reverse mathematics is received by? Classical reverse mathematicians. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's a bit hard to say. But uh, some of the, some of my colleagues from Tokyo University are uh, interested in it. Good. Yeah. But uh, the main topic in classical mathematics is Ramsey uh, theorem and combinatorics. Uh, it's it's too classical to have uh, to do something in the post Ah, that's an interesting statement. Okay, you say Ramsey theorems are too classical. Yes, uh, there are lots of disjunctions, and and they are proved often use some kind of uh, uh, by contradiction, and uh, it cannot be done in a post So it's a, do you say, would you say it cannot be done, or would you rather say it's hard? <laughs> 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 
sorry, but is it, is it, it is very hard. <laughs> so it's a, it's a challenge for us. <laughs>